A big thanks to all of my Patreon supporters. And a big thanks to all the donators of five dollars or more. Dead Zirkling. Radio Raptor. And Vlad Tepish 3176. You all helped make this possible. Howdy, insufferable gaming fans. Your old pal Rosser here. And courtesy of our old pal Vlad Tepish, I've got something new for you again today. This is Haunted Castle. The arcade game that Konami made before they made Castlevania. But it's kind of the precursor to Castlevania. I think there were also some home console versions and such, but this is the one that really feels like an original Castlevania game. Now, here's the thing about this. I've never gotten very far, because you can't just keep pumping quarters into it to get extra lives. No. You can start with, I think, up to three or four lives tops, and once you lose them, that's it. Game over. And I think you can only continue up to three times. So, you know, even if you have infinite money, it won't save you. It is only skill. And this wall is about as far as I ever got when I first tried playing the game way back in the day. But we're gonna try playing it again now. I'll start by pumping a few quarters in. And, well, quarters in quotation marks. Come on, you know what I mean. But I will maybe even keep track of how much money I would be putting into this if I were playing it on an actual arcade cabinet. Holy crap, it's Dracula. <laughs> By the way, that's Simon Belmont in a suit. Or at least, I assume it's Simon Belmont. Uh, oh my goodness, I do not have my controls set the way I want them. I've made a horrible error in judgment. That's okay, I'll work with it. I'm nothing if not adaptive. So you got stairs, you got statues. And those statues will hurt like hell if you let them crumble on top of you. Whoa, that's a zombie. Hey there, buddy. How you doing, bloody friend? Why don't you just sink back into the warm embrace of the grave there? And I'll be on me way. That bird did a little mid-air pirouette, didn't it? Okay. This is about as far as I made it last time. Oh, you'll notice that uh, that was about half, half my life in one hit, too. Now, I can get more life by pumping those quarters, but that's... As far as I can get, the more I putting more quarters in it, hammering on the start button won't help past this point. That's how much energy I have until I die. Unless maybe like beating the level. Oh, I did not see that coming. Ah, last. Well, that's a dude in a tree. By the way, I have the uh, settings to where I'm doing the max possible damage with my whip, and the game is on easy, and it still took half a life bar in one hit from a weak enemy. Just let that sink in for a bit. That's what we're dealing with here, people. This is true terror, my friends. Only the power of a hunter may save us now. Whoa, bats. So many bats. I can't help but notice that there's a time limit. But I have bombs, so that's cool. Maybe I'll throw bombs at some things. Alright. What do we have here? It's a mausoleum. It's a mausoleum full of bats. Why wouldn't it be full of bats? You know, bats like caves and dark places. And that's a Medusa. Didn't I just deal with her during the last game? Okay. 
we've come to a boss, it would seem. And I am dead. See, now that's a game over. That's what a game over looks like. So, we don't get to continue. You know, despite how much money we pump into it. That's kind of a problem. So, I'm going to take just a second here to fix... Oh, right. I can't pause an arcade game. Belay that thought. We'll do another run, and then I'll fix my controls. Because this jumping and whipping is very awkward on my D-pad at the moment. Very awkward. Uh, I could have used that heart to throw bombs. But really, were the bombs being that helpful? Oh right, I should pump up my life to the max. Which I have done. Ah, you stupid bird. I hate you so much. Oh right, this. Duck and whip. That's the order of the day here. You got two levels of bricks that can hit you in your big old noggin when you're ducking. So whip them both. Whip them, and might I add, whip them good. Right, there's gonna be fire coming up, isn't there? I'll just hop across these. Whoa! Easy there, fire. You just gotta calm the lotion. See, I'm doing better this time, I think. I wouldn't exactly swear to it, but I like to think that my game has improved on the second playing here. Zombies, you being a dick. Don't be a dick, zombies. Don't be a dick, bats. Bats? What did I just say? You need to settle your asses down. Ha! You missed me, statue. Absolutely eat it. Okay, so we got bats and we got medusas. I see the medusa in the spider web. Almost as if it had been sucked dry by a giant spider or maybe a Metroid. Why is the background purple? I can't tell where the bats are coming for me. This is this is bad. This is bad. I'm in trouble. Alright, jump the baby snakes. Can I whip the baby snakes? Kinda, but not really. Ugh. This is timing based. Ah, I got her! Haha! -ha. Yay! This is the farthest I've ever been. So, what's next? Okay, this is really disorienting. And, again. I, wow, I'm going from right to left? That's uh, practically unheard of. I didn't get a heal after that level. I would just like to point that out. But I got my trusty Jesus orang. Um, hello? Oh. I go down here. In theory. Okay, apparently I can't go in the water. Do not go into the water. Do not. And I forgot to reset my controls again. Go team me.
I'll just uh, pump the old energy up. We're doing this. This is happening. If I could just get through Medusa's nonsense. But I can't even get through the regular game's nonsense. At least not yet. Why am I playing this, you might ask? Well, no one seemed particularly interested in me trying to beat Bloodlines with another character. So, this is the next thing. This is the next big thing. Haunted Castle. Boy, howdy is this bordering on the impossible, but that's okay. I'm sure someone playtested it. All it's gonna take is a little bit of rote memorization, and everything will be peachy keen. Picho Kino, as the kids almost certainly have never said in their lives. But I said it just now. It's a thing, damn it. We're making it a thing. Or not. That's fine, too. I don't actually need to fight that guy. But I do remember that there are multiple zombies here. It would have made me feel a lot better if I hadn't just gotten hit by that particular one. But I did. And there's going to be a lot of bats. Just really so many bats. I want that bomb. I'm not going to get that bomb. I got that bomb. Okay. Let's do some bat dodging. U.S. Olympic bat dodging. That's the team I'm on. Actually, it seems like dodging the bats uh, is easier if I stay kind of around the edge there. Ah. Crap. Actually, that was pretty easy. Uh, now, if I could just find some wall meat, I'll be all set. I'm guessing wall meat doesn't exist. That is more levels than I want to try to get through on one life bar. Ah, really? That's not how you dodge those? Then what is? Not that, neither. Bye, Boomerang. I miss you. Alright. Go down the stairs. And jump over this away. Mermans! And a river of blood, because Castlevania is metal as hell, and it had to come from somewhere. Hmm. Uh, can I not... There we go. That was very awkward. That is solid ground? Really? Okay. I'll take your word for it there, game. Ooh, floating platforms! No, 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 no. Game, you must chill. I know there's going to be more bats. I'm near water. There are always bats near water. Or those friggin' Medusa heads. Ah! You hit me from behind! What a dick! What a horrible, horrible person that bat was. Bats are people too, right? Stopwatch! I've never wanted to see a stopwatch in my life, but... I'm happy to see it now? Question mark? Maybe not. It only uses two hearts. Wow. 
this is a lot different from the classic Bone Dragons I am used to. Look out. Oh, I am so gonna take damage off of that. Okay. I got it! I've got one hit left. Come on, wall meat. There's no wall meat. There's never gonna be any wall meat, is there? This is it. Alright, which way am I going? Uh, I may have stopped that mud man a little premature. There we go, okay. Well, that's another attempt down. Alright. Stick some more quarters in, and I am going to stop for just a minute and uh, work on my controls. So, give me one second. Okay, had to reset it. But, that's okay. Let's try this again. I'm going to try not doing multiple lives and seeing if I get anywhere like that. I mean multiple lives at once, of course. Like, seeing if, uh... Just using the old continue option helps me at all. I'm not overly optimistic, but uh, you never know. Things might work out for me. Okay, they're not working out for me yet. Ah. You know what? Nope, nope. Not going to accept this. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Nope. So... If I do it like this, I can continue, but only three times, so I might as well just pump the money, or the, uh, continues into an extended life bar. Just right off the- you know what? Let's put some damn quarters in this thing! Yeah! Alright, that's as much health as I'm ever gonna get. And I have to get through the entire game on it. Just let that sink in. I mean, you thought Castlevania 1 on the NES was hard? No. Castlevania 1 on the NES wasn't jack compared to this. Not a damn thing. It was a walk in the park. A delightful school outing, even. But hey. I dealt with Medusa. Now I just need to learn how to dodge the bats. And I will, in theory, be golden. Right? Right. Right? Right. I might be repeating myself a bit, but... You know, I didn't have this game in the one arcade that was in the next town over from my house. And I did have to go to the next town over to get to an arcade. It was a 20 minute drive up a 45 degree mountain slope, so it's not like I could just walk there either. But I'd go to the arcade, and, you know... My mom would do the shopping while I'd be in the arcade, and I'd sit in, and I'd walk around that arcade, and I'd watch other people play games for hours, because I didn't have enough quarters to play games my own self. But I'd watch people play games, and it was fun. As a kid who loved all things video game, the arcades always impressed me with their cutting-edge graphics. Now, if I did have a quarter or two, what I would do is I'd play the hell out of some pinball and some air hockey. Oh, I took a hit. Well, that was the first hit I've taken this run, and it's just because I wasn't paying attention. All right, bats. You all need to get dodged.
I need to get over here before Medusa shows up. Okay. That was only partially disastrous. Alright, jump the snakelets. All the snakelets, if you please. I couldn't jump all the snakelets, could I? And she was way too close for my liking. And that's why some of those bombs missed. Which sucks. It sucks. Just a little. Just a little bit. Maybe a little bit of suckitude. Ha! Ah, you missed me! You have flying, cackling jackanapes. Well, now that I've learned how to dodge those, the world is my oyster, I suppose. Too bad I can't dodge bats. That's still an issue. I can't get my boomerang and I'm gonna get hit anyway and I'm losing all my health! And I don't have my boomerang! Come back, boomerang! Come back! Come back, I need you! It's gone. At least... Okay. Shut my mouth. I'm gonna have to memorize the locations of these rocks, aren't I? Right, have to get way back with this one. There's another rock that's gonna come. Yep, ha, dodged it. I did, it's true. True story. Dodge, dodge the rock, but not the bat. Sometimes, I don't quite dodge the bat. So I can just stand on these, and the only hazard is that they're hard to see because they're underwater. I appreciate that. You know what else I would appreciate? Some of that good old-fashioned wall meat. I might as well be grasping at straws. Hi, stopwatch. You are appreciated. Ah, I gotta... So, one pit, and it's game over in this game. One pit. One pit. Are you soaking this in? Are you understanding what it all means? This is not a game for the faint of heart. And Simon just flexes his muscles and he's already wearing the armor under it. The armor under the uh, suit. He's just like... Rawr! Suit shrapnel goes flying everywhere, and Simon's like, nah, nah, I ain't wearing no damn suit. I got Draculas to attack. I got bats to whip. And I can't let anything stop me from my mission of bat whipping. And zombie whipping. Zombie whipping is also a thing that occurs in this... These grim times of the Romanian countryside. Ah. This is not an auspicious start, is it? Well, some of my greatest victories have come from inauspicious starts, so... It's not like I'm just gonna give up. If I'd gotten hit in three or four times, you know, that would be a restart. But no. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. See, when I get to where I can consistently beat Medusa without taking a hit, you know, I can kind of start cutting that out. But until then, you're going to have to sit here and watch me do this over and over again while I learn the ropes. Not ropes, whips! Simon uses whips. I'd be interested to know if he was even called Simon in this version. There was not exactly any story other than what you guys saw when Dracula just pimped on down and stole the nice lady. 
it was just like, whoop. Sorry, butthole. You're not getting married today. And I was like, that's not cool. That's not cool at all, Dracula. And then I solved my problems with whipping and bombs. But mostly whipping. But a few bombs. Alright. Deal with this. Be over here. Ah. Couldn't just quite get that last little bit of help on that, could I? 35 out of 64 health. Times are tough. Times are tough all around. I wonder if I can get my boomerang this time. I need to watch out for the bats. Ah, I was hoping I could kill that guy, but I couldn't. It didn't work out for me. You! You dropped the boomerang, right? You do! Go, 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 go! I got it! Morning star! Holy shit, you can actually get a morning star in this game? Well, if I'd known that... I mean, I wouldn't have done anything different, but I'd have at least known that it was possible. Uh, and... Here's a problem we have right off the bat with that. It seemed to cause me a little bit of problems hitting Mr. Merman. Mr. Merman made it through that unscathed. And then I got hit by a huge ass rock. I mean a huge ass rock. Why? Why why would I why would I even I don't I don't why no 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 man no don't don't do that. Bye, Flail. I'll miss you. If I can figure out why and how I got the Flail, I'll get a new Flail. Or maybe it's the old ball and chain. Because a Flail tends to be shorter. Morning Star, maybe. There's a lot of misconceptions about the proper names of a lot of medieval melee weaponry in video games. I don't want to act like I'm an expert on this subject, but one thing's for sure. I know the difference between a glaive and a shuriken. We've been over this in previous episodes of other series, though. I don't want to harp on it too much. Flying cinder blocks are no match for my leather whip. Damn straight. Jack be nimble, Jack be quick. Moku jeans. That's wood people. Maybe. I'm not a word wizard. Let's just take it slow here and try not to get uh, zombied upon. He almost got me anyway. He about had my number. Alright. Let the bats do the thing. Listen to the skeletons gurgle in the bucket. Grab my bombs. Wow! Nice job there, Mr. Bat. You worked overtime. You earned your keep. 
Now, if I can avoid taking the initial hit from Medusa, that would be swell. Easier said than done, really. All things considered, being what they are. I should probably, like... That was easier than usual. I guess I'm getting better or something. I don't think I've ever gotten to this level with this much health before. But there's like three levels after that still. I mean, you guys realize that's huge and insane, right? It's pretty big. Bye. Bye. Bye, Boomerang. And I didn't even get my flail that time, so... I don't know why I got it the first time. I don't know what I did differently. Other than, you know, not getting hit by that zombie. That was kind of different. Ah, you stupid boulder, I hate you so much! Alright. Oh, I made a mistake. I made a bad mistake. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. Who knows? Maybe this will be the time that I make that crucial bit of progress. I mean, sure, I haven't beaten that uh, dragon again. Oh. Okay. Alright, I think that's enough effort for one day. Join me next time, and hopefully I'll be able to beat another level. Until then, thanks for watching. This is your old pal Rosser. Take a drink.